that we have available to us in treating aneurysms is actually a very exciting uh, uh, piece of technology. It's called the pipeline embolization device, which is a stent-like structure. We place it across the neck of an aneurysm and uh, minimally invasively, again, going through the leg or femoral artery. And by placing it across the neck of the aneurysm, it kind of diverts blood away from the aneurysm and forces it to go past the aneurysm and into the normal vessel, distal to it, past it. This technology has allowed us to treat aneurysms that we were not able to treat or at all, or, or it was very difficult to treat in the past. For example, this is an aneurysm, in a very giant aneurysm in a patient. You can see this bulge is the aneurysm. This is the carotid artery in the brain. Uh, this is very difficult to treat surgically, if not impossible. You have to do a bypass operation, which is a very morbid operation. And from an endovascular coiling standpoint, you can come and get inside it and put coils in it, but uh, that's a lot of coils and uh, causing a lot of mass effect on important structures in the brain. This is very big. Uh, what we did in this case was put a pipeline device across the neck of it, and it, by diverting blood away from the aneurysm, this thing thrombosis up and goes away. So you come back in six months to a year, uh, there, there'll be no aneurysm or any evidence of aneurysm because it's completely uh, reabsorbed. We basically relieve the pressure on the brain and the surrounding structures by, by using the pipeline.